Welcome everyone to BCC Art Studio. I'm Billy, and today we are going to do some. I'm going to make some a patch. So I'm going to use my metallic foils from Artistic Painting Studio. And if you go to our Artistic Painting Studio, Jen. She will show you all kinds of things and neat stuff that you can do with foils, clothing, hats, all kinds of stuff. Um, I will leave a link in the description below. So first off, I have a piece of leather patch. It is, it's got a sticky back. It's got tape on it, of course. But So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the Arts, Artsyville Embellishments. This is a foil adhesive. Um, it's for furniture and craft coatings by Artistic Painting Studio. So, we will get started as soon as I can get it open. Alright, and so it is a milky, creamy white. So what you want to do is you want to try to get a soft brush and when you brush this on you want to kind of go in one direction because if you put it in all different directions when you put your foil on you're going to see those lines. So try to keep it in one direction and here we go. So as you can see, the streaks and the lines that you get from this, that will show up. So try to be as gentle as possible. Make sure every spot is covered. Now this will dry clear, so The difficult part is trying to not touch the top. And trying not to get it all over your hands, especially with a thin piece like this. All right, I think that's gonna have to be good enough because otherwise I'm gonna mess it up. So this stuff washes off your brush really easy. So I will be back after I clean my brush. Okay, so while we were waiting for that um, piece of leather to dry, I am going to be taking my hat and using spray adhesive to seal this before I put the foil adhesive on there. Now spraying this should help seal um, should help seal it for air leaks or anything like that. Helps, I guess it helps to for the foil adhesive to stick better. So I'm gonna go spray this and I will be back. Okay, so it is time to put the foil onto the leather patch. So like I said I have my foil, this is the one I picked, and this is sticky of course. So I'm going to place it on there and then we are going to brush it on. So I want to use I want to use my soft cloth first and just rub it in there. It's 
Looks like it'll slow down, otherwise the camera's gonna shake. Okay, so now I'm going to take, I found that this scrubby stuff works really well, so I'm gonna use my scrubby. And I go around and just go in circles. And as you can see, the difference in color, you can see that it's coming off and it's sticking on to the leather patch. Now you don't need to get the edges perfect, but because we're going to be cutting out of the center, so. But you do want to make sure you get the center and everything off as much as you can. And we will check and see how it's coming out. And the corner is pulling up, which is not too bad anyway, but. And as you can see, it's pulling up. Now I am kind of pressing hard because of the fact that I can see the paint lines or the, the adhesive paint that I, you know, it's all going this way. So I can tell where it's not in. And so I'm gonna grab my toothbrush and see if I can't get in there a little better. This time I did have a toothbrush. So I do have a few spots like right in here that did not get there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two spots there, a couple spots there. So I'm just checking to see if it's sticky and it is not. So I'm gonna have to put some more adhesive there and do it again. Now I have not been waiting like four hours for this to dry. As soon as I see it's clear. I put the foil on. Maybe that's why I have such difficulty getting it off, but it still works out. <clears throat> so you can see some spots still didn't cover, like right there, right there, right there. So, no, still looks pretty neat though. So, there's that. So I decided that I want to put another foil over the top of this one. And I picked this one. The blue will show through once I'm done, but I just gotta make sure I have the right side. Hopefully. See how this is turning out. Look at that. Look at how that turned out. 
Nice. So that is two foils over one another. And it took care of those spots. This is, I like that foil a lot better. I mean, now if you use this foil without another foil, you'd have to put a color underneath. I mean, you don't have to if you're using something like this, you don't really have to, but if you're gonna use like just white or anything, you'd probably wanna put a color underneath. Okay, so here is the results of my leather patch. On the hat. I think it turned out really nice. I like that rose paper foil that's on top of that metallic blue. Turned out really good. Well, thank you for watching and happy pouring.